These are just some of the beautiful paintings that SBS staff are privileged to be surrounded by each day. These U-shapes are very important as well because you'll see them through some of the works that we see today. The U-shapes are women or men sitting down. The guided tour of the loaned works was held as part of Art Month in Sydney and offered a unique insight into the 21st century Aboriginal artworks which have been collected by businessman Pat Corrigan. Well, I've been collecting Indigenous art only for about uh, seven or eight years. I decided to specialise in paintings only painted from the year 2000 because the field was so large back to early uh, historic paintings. So this way I've specialised and I've also specialise in very, very colourful paintings and hopefully really good ones too. The collection features paintings from across Australia, including the Western Desert and Utopia regions and far north Queensland. Most of them relate to water. Most of these people are, are, are water people like Sally Gabori and uh, I just get more and more fascinated each time I hear another story. You haven't got enough time to hear all the stories. <laughs> The event was launched last night by SBS Managing Director Michael Ebed. Our staff come into work every single day and we walk through these hallways and I have no doubt that these pieces add to our creativity. They inspire us in everything that we do. They inspire us to be innovative as well as creative. So I think we're lucky to be able to have them filled in our hallways to, to lift our own spirits and, and creativity. It's the second year that SBS has hosted the event and Pat Corrigan says it won't be the last. I was approached by the founder of Art Month four or five years ago and said, would you like to be a sponsor? Would you like to be a helper, a patron to Art Month? I put my hand up and I'm still there and I'll be there for the fifth Art Month, the sixth Art Month, the seventh Art Month. You know. And until next year's Art Month, art buffs can see some of the stunning Corrigan Collection works in the book Power and Colour.